Hey guys, welcome back to the Fashion After Show and we're going to be carrying the highlights from the SAG Awards 2020. You All right. Know, you who? already know. My name is Reina Kamala Queen and we have... Sayini. All right. All right, let's get into it. Let's start with Millie. Millie. Bobby Brown. Yes. All right, so her piece for me was very classy, very, classy. very nice. I mean, it said award, it, but it, it, it was simple but to the point and very elegant. I love when people come and she was wearing Louis Vuitton, by the way, style by Todd Phillips. She looked amazing. Yeah. She had her hair down, straight, beautiful part, white dress. And I love when you bring something that has a little cape. Yes. It had like a little cape pants vibe. It was great. Loved her look, loved her look. Very clean, very nice. All right, very, who very else? Clean. All right, so. We also saw Cynthia Erbio, mm -hmm. styled by Jason Bolden. She looked amazing. Vogue has already said she was best dressed. This pink balloon vibe going on. It was just yeah. gorgeous. What did you think of it? Absolutely amazing. I think the color pops on her a lot, you know, so that was really good. Of course, we can't stop about Zoe Kravitz. Beautiful. She ha she is always beautiful. She's here for uh you know big lies or big little lies, mm -hmm. and she looked amazing. She gave me classic Audrey Hepburn white gloves, dainty top, short hair. As you know, she is our new cat woman. So she's whatever she does, pixie. We love it. Love 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 Zoe Kravitz. She does a sultry. She does a sexy. She's always on point. Yeah. When we saw we saw Sophie Turner. Mm. Right, Sophie Turner, Game of Thrones, and you know X Men Phoenix. She is Loves so her. gorgeous. Hot She's pink. gorgeous. Yeah. You can't go wrong with a hot pink gown. It had like a cute little buckle belt. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? She looked amazing. Who else did you remember on the carpet? Jennifer Lopez. All right. <laughs> of course. So Jennifer was wearing this black ensemble, and it was really, really elegant, really nice. I mean, everything about Jennifer always pops. Even the jewelry, the silver, complemented it well. She looked amazing. You know what? She spent so much time getting ready for this carpet, and her glam team is all the way popping. I mean, she never goes wrong. Like she literally cannot go wrong. It doesn't matter what she does, she can't go wrong because she's J Lo. She didn't stop. But like, uh, let's get into our some of our Black Panther crowd, okay? Let Pita. Lupita looked amazing. Yeah. I love what Lupita was wearing. You know, Lupita. Uh, I know Vernon does her hair. That's yeah. all that I know. And she looks It's always amazing. so good. Her hair is always different, unique, but it's always so good. Always and she so always good. stands out. You know, yeah. she's really nice. And she's been doing this thing with her hair. They look like, they call them Afro clouds. They look like yeah. floating clouds on her hair. She had like a slip part, one on the top, one in the back. You know, classic white and black. Lupita she never knows. gets it wrong. She, she never gets, gets it wrong. When I love when she was campaigning, it, she always looks the great. Let's get to Joey King wearing black lace. Sexy. She like something like what I have on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Girl, don't forget. Um, you you like to Camila Mendez, right? You saw her from uh, Riverdale. Yes. What did, how do you think she looked? Of course, she was beautiful. I mean, all of them are really stunning. But Camilla, there was just something about Camilla that really it was a stood champagne out. Champagne type yeah. dress, low V neck, off the shoulder sleeves. She looked amazing, stunning, stunning. I don't know, but she looked great. It looks great. Uh, who else? Who else? There was Jennifer Aniston. Jennifer was very nice too. Yeah, she always has this thing where she she looks shy, but she's not really shy. But like her outfits are always very nice and you know and sultry as well. The men that popped for me tonight, Caleb, Caleb from Stranger Things. He looked amazing. I the blue. blue. Yeah. Bright, bright blue, and he had an interesting detail right at the tip of the bottom of his pants. Mm. I mean, it was nice. It looked great. He wore them with shoes, the flooding pants a little bit, but it worked. And then the hair. Yeah. He was giving us natural, lovely vibes. Which is always good. Always and of course, good. Leonardo DiCaprio and Brad Pitt, we got to talk about them. Okay. Listen, exactly. listen. listen. They were, they were, were so a, dope. Were oh, girl. Like, hey. <laughs> I almost did. <laughs> she almost did. Well, I was like, <laughs> I, nah, I don't want to be thrown off, but that's fine. But yeah, we can't wait to see who the winners are, though. That's yes. the most important part. The winners are coming because it's not all about fashion, even though we love it and all that. But it really is about the winners, and we're excited. So I want you guys to keep it locked right here because we're going to go backstage right now and check out who's going to win. The show's going to start. And congratulations to the nominees as well. You're all winners. You are all winners because for the fact that you were nominated in the first place means that you've done something extremely good. Something yeah. Now so let's go see. Yeah, we got All right. Fashion camera walk.